so much. good always to see you. We know we're going to have a great night. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. I had a great time on Saturday with the Virtuosos crowd, which was unforgettable to have Taryn Edgerton there singing and Cynthia Erivo breaking into karaoke. Amazing. And Aldous Hodge was great. Aquafina, Beanie Felsen. It was really a special night. One of, I think, maybe my favorite Virtuosos night of the 10 that I've done. And this is the first time I've been asked to do a solo tribute. Lucky so us. I'm happy that it's Lupita Nyong'o, someone that I met six years ago when she was doing the campaign for 12 Years a Slave. I'm going to tell a story tonight about the first time I met her at the Dolby Theater. I got to show her around the Dolby Theater where the Oscars are. She had never been there before and we had a, a really good time and then four months later she was back on that stage winning the Oscars. So it's a, it'll be a fun full circle story to tell. Amazing. Jordan, talk a little bit about her performance in Us. I am mesmerized by her performance in Us. I liked it a lot when I saw it almost a year ago, but in preparation for tonight, I watched it again. And when you know the ending of the movie, Us, her performance is 20 times more impressive because you see all of the things that she does and the things that she doesn't do to give away or not give away the surprise twist ending of the movie. It's incredible incredible what she does in this, and I'm so glad that she got a Screen Actors Guild Award nomination for it. It's almost like you have to go see the film again right away, because now you know. I think it's helpful to see us more than once. For me, it was 10 months between seeing it the first time and seeing it the second time, and that was still great, but I would imagine that for people who see it a second time immediately, yeah. it will blow their mind. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, she's receiving the Montecito Award tonight. Why is she so deserving of this? Lupita Nyong'o is someone who has taken her incredible talent and been very choosy about the kinds of roles and kinds of films that she decides to do. And whenever she signs on to something, you know it's going to be very interesting. And whether it's a more kind of family-friendly Disney movie like Queen of Cotway or something completely edgy like Us or a Broadway performance that she decides to do or motion capture in Star Wars, you know it's going to be fascinating because she's so intelligent and she brings that intelligence to every performance she gives and I love that about her and she's so beautiful and glamorous and just smart and nice too so I'm looking forward to actually having a good hour to chat with her tonight well, excellent well, we're looking forward to having you do it because just like what you said about her we know that when you're here we're in for a real treat that's very nice of you thank you so thank much, you Dave. so much see you next year absolutely all right bye <laughs>